नमस्कार वेलकम टू गवर्नमेंट ई मार्केट प्लेस प्री रेक्विजिट फॉर प्रोफाइल कम्पलीशन हेयर आर द डिटेल्स ऑफ पैन कार्ड फॉर वेरियस टाइप्स ऑफ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन प्रोपराइटरशिप पैन फोर्थ लेटर ऑफ पैन शुड बी पी इफ यू आर रजिस्टरिंग अ सोल प्रोपराइटरशिप बिजनेस पार्टनरशिप और एल एल पी पैन फोर्थ लेटर ऑफ पैन शुड बी एफ इफ यू आर रजिस्टरिंग अ फर्म कंपनी पैन फोर्थ लेटर ऑफ पैन शुड बी सी इफ यू आर रजिस्टरिंग अ प्राइवेट और पब्लिक लिमिटेड कंपनी ट्रस्ट और सोसाइटी पैन फोर्थ लेटर ऑफ पैन शुड बी टी और ए और बी इफ यू आर रजिस्टरिंग अ ट्रस्ट और सोसाइटी और एसोसिएशन ऑफ पर्सन गवर्नमेंट पैन फोर्थ लेटर ऑफ पैन शुड बी जी इफ यू आर रजिस्टरिंग एज सेंट्रल और स्टेट गवर्नमेंट यू विल नीड डेट ऑफ इनकॉर्पोरेशन और रजिस्ट्रेशन ऑफ योर बिजनेस सी आई एन कंपनी इंफॉर्मेशन नंबर इन केस यू आर रजिस्टरिंग एज अ प्राइवेट और पब्लिक लिमिटेड कंपनी इनकम टैक्स रिटर्न डिटेल्स आई टी आर फॉर्म एंड आई टी आर एक्नोलिजमेंट फॉर द लास्ट थ्री ईयर्स डी आई पी पी नंबर इफ यू आर रजिस्टर्ड अंडर स्टार्ट अप इंडिया उद्यम नंबर इफ यू आर अ माइक्रो और अ स्मॉल एंटरप्राइज बैंक डिटेल्स अकाउंट नंबर एंड आई एफ एस सी कोड फॉर द अकाउंट विच विल बी यूज फॉर बिजनेस डन ऑन जेम बिलिंग एड्रेस विद जी एस टी आई एन नंबर In the absence of GST IN, you will not be able to accept any orders beyond INR 2.5 lakhs on Gem. Your profile section is divided into four section. Under My Company, you will see many fields. Required fields are PAN validation, company details, office location, bank accounts, e-invoice declaration. Optional fields are tax assessment, MSE, startup, DOE order compliance. Under My Action, you will see the following tabs: Vendor Assessment (OEM Panel), Reseller Panel, Change Business or Organization Type, Close Account. Under the Personal Setting, you will see the following options: Change Password, Change Email, Update Aadhaar (in case registered with Aadhaar), Update Mobile (in case registered with PAN). Under My Team tab, you will see the following option. Add secondary user. Open gem. gov. in and click on login. Enter the user ID, the captcha text, and click submit. Enter the password and click on submit. From the drop-down menu, click My Account to proceed further. If you are registering as a sole proprietor business, registration using PAN, PAN details will be pre-filled in PAN validation in My Company section. Registration using Aadhaar. Enter details as in PAN validation. Name should be same as in Aadhaar. In case of proprietorship PAN, fourth letter of PAN should be P. In case you wish to change constitution type at the time of PAN validation, same can be done only once. You just need to enter respective PAN details as per business or organization type. For example, if you registered your account as trust or society or association of persons. and wish to change it to firm enter pan of your firm at the time of pan validation this message will appear if you proceed further your business or organization type will change accordingly same can be done for any other type click here to proceed fill in the date of incorporation please fill in the date carefully as this can be edited one time only click here to proceed in case Your business or organization type is company. Additional information required is CIN. After the user enters CIN, business or organization name, type of company, date of incorporation will be mapped as per CIN details provided automatically. Note: CIN can be revalidated after 90 days. Click here to proceed. Click here to proceed further. Select the options as applicable. If you are a startup, click yes. If you are registered with Startup India, please provide these details. Fill in your DIPP number along with mobile number linked with Startup India. If you have not registered with Startup India, click here. Click here to proceed further. If you are registered with MSME as micro or small enterprise, click yes. Enter your Udyam number. and linked mobile number and click here to verify if you want to participate in bid click yes and click on save to continue 
If the date of incorporation is more than 24 months and you do not provide ITR records, you will not be able to participate in bids. Fill in the office location details. It is mandatory to provide the registered address. You can choose the type of office from the drop-down menu. Confirm your billing address also. Email verification is required to authenticate or validate address updation. Click here to receive OTP. For receiving orders valued over 30 lakhs, GSTIN is required. Note, the GST type can be changed only once. Composition scheme to normal taxpayer. Choose Yes if you are registered with GST and select if you are registered under Normal Taxpayer or Composition Scheme. Enter the GSTIN and verify. Choose No if you are not registered with GST and select the correct option from Declaring As. Select the undertaking and click on Update and Save. Click here to proceed. Companies and firms are required to verify key person information as per ITR records. Click here after filling in the details to proceed further. Click here to proceed. Fill in your bank details and save. For verified turnover details, values will come automatically for turnover tab. For no turnover details, new users or unverified turnover details, user will need to enter details as self-input. Please read the instructions carefully and fill in the ITR details. Click on New and add ITR for different financial year. Select the ITR type, ITR3, ITR4, ITR5, ITR6. For illustration, we have selected ITR5. Click here to proceed further. Read the clauses successfully and agree with the clauses. Your profile is complete. On 100% completion, My Actions, My Team, and personal setting tabs get activated. Sellers who are not exempted need to apply for vendor assessment. Sellers who are exempted have to initiate the vendor assessment exemption request. Sellers must provide mandatory documents required to create exemption before proceeding to vendor assessment exemption request. List of documents will be available in assessment exemption documents tab as shown. You can view the seller details here. Account can only be closed in case no catalog is uploaded in the account. You can review the list of users here. You can add secondary user and define roles here. Maximum 50 secondary users can be added. You can choose more than one role for secondary user. Click on add user to proceed. The activation link will be sent to the secondary user's mail. Once they activate their account, list of users will start reflecting in the user list tab. Thank you.